Steve Liebenthal with Beyond Your Side Forecast. And a nice sunny week for the most part, but now we're getting back to storminess and showers starting to move in. Some scatter showers around the Treasure Valley, snow moving into those mountain locations, and it will persist right through at least midday and possibly even later in those mountain locations. Pretty much a typical day for mid-February today. We got up to 45 degrees, exactly normal. 30 degrees was our morning low, pretty close to average. A record of 64 only set nine years ago. 40 degrees, our current temperature in in Boise, we're in the 20s in mountain locations and just a bit of a breeze out there making it feel a bit cooler. Feels like 35 right now in Boise and 37 in Mountain Home. Wind chill of 28 degrees in Twin Falls at this moment. And here is a live look at the Mid Mountain Snow Stake at Tamarack Resort. And as you can see, there's snow coming down, not coming down heavily just yet, but uh, these showers will get heavier and again will persist for the better part of the morning, if not uh, all of the day, really, in some places in the mountains tomorrow. So by 10 o'clock in the morning, four inches of fresh powder at Bogus Basin, six inches of fresh powder at Tamarack Resort, and close to nine inches of fresh powder at Brundage. That is at opening time at the ski resorts and then more snow will accumulate and by the time we get through Tuesday between now and actually late on Monday 14 inches possible at uh, Brundage Mountain. They've been getting a lot of snow and it just continues to come And the area shaded in purple here is a winter weather advisory that goes through 11 o'clock tomorrow morning. So if you're headed up north uh, be prepared for some difficult travel conditions, but if you're headed that way to ski or snowboard, it will be very nice once you arrive there. The cold front coming through with this will have some wind behind it, and then cooler temperatures as our skies clear out on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. We expect morning lows in the teens here in the Treasure Valley. And you can see early in the morning, 2 o'clock, the rain already moving into the Treasure Valley as the snow continues to accumulate in the mountains. By noon, the rain still with us here in the upper Treasure Valley, and then it will move out of the way. Skies will clear, but there will be lots of wind tomorrow behind that front as well. So be prepared for a bit of a blustery afternoon, even though our afternoon highs will hit the mid and even upper 40s. Vail, Oregon expecting 52 degrees tomorrow afternoon, but it will be a windy 52 degrees. So uh, be prepared for that rain in the morning and then wind in the afternoon. In the mountains, 6 to 12 inches above 5,500 feet, 3 to 6 inches below that level. Afternoon highs staying just below freezing in place places like McCall in Stanley, a low of 23 and a high of only 28. Watch for that snow to really accumulate here, 6 to 12 inches likely. Magic Valley, you're going to get rain in the valley, snow in the southern highlands, morning lows just above freezing and afternoon highs in the low to middle 40s. So 38 for our low tomorrow morning, 45 for the afternoon high with that rain. Maybe a rain shower or two on Monday morning with a low of 28. Skies clear out after that. Temperatures drop 18 degrees is our forecast low for Wednesday. 19 degrees for Thursday morning, but those afternoon highs, not bad. 44 next Thursday, pretty close to average. 47 right on. And then a week from today on Saturday, we're right back to the 50s with an afternoon high of 52 degrees. So if you like to ski uh, and you want to make first tracks, tomorrow would be a good day to do that. Some fresh pow pow maybe?